All right, guys, name is Tyler, aka Nanogenics, and today we've got a bit of a special mystery unboxing because Bandai sent me two boxes, one yesterday, which I actually opened on a live stream, which is what we're going to be hopping into first to be kind of an edited down version of me opening that live over there on Twitch. And then secondly, we've got this right here that they just sent me as well today. So I figured we could combine them both together. Now, I have kind of an idea what might be in this, but I had literally no idea what was in yesterday's at all and i actually had no idea that this one was even coming either so um let's hop into the twitch one first and then we'll hop into getting this one open as well so bandai sent me this damn that's good actually kind of nice presentation if i'm being 100 percent with you right now the paper inside literally says dragon ball what what what? Yo. Yo, that's kind of clean. <laughs> Kakarot shoes. You're you're wilding out if you think there's shoes in here. I guess that, that does kind of look like that could be a shoe box. Dude, this tag is freaking nice. I never I've never owned anything from Primitive, so that's pretty dope. Oh my god. This is a bath bomb. <laughs> Hang on, I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna show this to my wife as soon as I'm done here. Dude, Sensu beans. What? All right, that's kind of cool. Hang on, can I get? All right, we might have to do something with these. <laughs> that's dope. Heal your hand. Eat one of these in my hand. In Dude, that would be the best thing ever. Are you kidding me? What? All right, that's kind of dope. You want me to try a Sensu bean? What makes you think I'm going to lose to Rhyme and Legends? <laughs> that looked like a hole. It still kind of looks like a hole. Oh yeah, there's holes all over it. Dude, this is fancy. What in the world? What? Yo. Okay, that's... <laughs> that's kind of dope. I'm not going to lie. What is this? Bro. All right, that display is sick. I was not expecting, like, that level of presentation. All right, that's pretty cool. All right, let me show my wife this bath bomb real quick. One sec. Uh, yeah, she thought that was pretty cool. So, something I just remembered... That you guys just watched that Twitch unboxing was everyone in chat asked me to eat these Dragon Ball Z Kakarot Sensu beans. Now, obviously, they're just jelly beans, but I'm wondering what they taste like. Like right now, before I actually get into them, go down to the comment section and let me know what you think they're gonna taste like. Green apple? Are they gonna be gross? Like, what would a Sensu bean taste like? You know? All right, here we go. Yep, green apple. Hang on, let's do the segment just to make sure. Green apple and absolutely fantastic. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Now I just wish it was actually bigger than that. Not that I need to sit here and just be like popping in jelly beans and sorry, sensu beans and stuff, but still, those are those are pretty sick. Alright, set those aside. Let's get into this. Yeah, that, that's that's what I figured was in this. So we got this massive Dragon Ball Z Kakarot box. I don't even remember what I was in this. Oh, this comes with a hard... What? Yo, a hardcover game animation. Is that what that says? Sorry, hardcover game art book. Collectible still book. That massive statue there, or sorry, diorama, and then the actual game itself. Let's hop in. Uh, and the reason why I said I figured I knew what this was is because the one came yesterday and I assumed that was all I was getting from them. So the one I mentioned I got yesterday and the reason why I said I figured I knew what was in this because the fact that I got a Bandai package yesterday and then I got this one today, which I, I didn't know they were actually sending this. They just mentioned they were going to send me some sort of like Kakarot goodie or something or Kakarot goodies basically. And I just assumed it was going to be like the game, like physically maybe, but definitely not a collector's edition. So when I got yesterday's thing, I was like, oh, 
Okay, well, cool. Was obviously very, very happy. So then to, to, to see something else get here today, I was like, hold up. <laughs> like, wait, what? All right, y'all, this is, this is sick, man. Look at... So I something that I don't really talk about much here on the channel, I collect still books. Like, I've... Maybe the next time I do like a vlog or something, I'll sh I'll show you guys all my still books. I have a lot of them, and they're not just Dragon Ball related, obviously, just a ton of still books. So, this is beautiful. Like this is awesome, dude. Are you kidding me? And then it says Dragon Ball Z Kakarot on the spine. I was trying to make it focus closer in, but I got this massive box, so I can't really move closer to the camera to make it focus. Then we got the actual game itself, still wrapped in the box. Okay. I was not expecting that. Usually when these come like this, they're like, I don't know, they're just not quite still like that. So that's kind of dope. And there's the top of this. Looks like the book is on top. Oh, the book is like in this. Okay. It's a lot thinner than I thought it would be. Just like looking at it from that picture. But man, dude, this looks very, very nice. By the way, hashtag free product, all that stuff. I mean, I literally it's titled Bandai sent me this. So that should be pretty evident. But there's a message from here. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot is an action RPG full of the Dragon Ball universe. It includes backstories that haven't been told in the manga, and I'm sure fans will truly be able to take a deeper dive into the world. It's a fresh new take on the franchise as you relive the moment where Goku discovers his Saiyan bloodline and birth name Kakarot. Experience the battles as they grow to become more and more unrelenting and fierce through cutting-edge game visuals. I hope you enjoy the game. From the author, Kira Toriyama. By the way, if you haven't seen anything about the game yet, the like menu art and stuff like this over here, dude it's incredible i'm not obviously going to flip through this whole book for the sake of just this video not being forever long but it looks like it dives into each character pretty deep and shows you different cutscenes and stuff like that and their different models that's really cool very very cool all right so classic box inside a box here Dude, how many pieces of tape do they put on this? <laughs> More tape, I am sure. Yes. Oh my god. I was trying to just do like one side, because sometimes on these you can just get away with like one side. And he's kind of like flap it open, you know? I think I can do that now with these top ones off. <laughs> Just trying to get it out of my space, man. Oh my gosh. All right, here we go. Okay. All right. When I first saw this, I was like, I thought it looked cool, but it wasn't anything like too impressive because a lot of times these collector's editions, like... I don't know just the extra thing you get with them just doesn't seem as nice as you would want it to be or the things that they released but i can confirm to you for one this has like some actual weight to it and for two it looks awesome dude like r some real solid weight to it and it looks really really good man i mean goku's goku and gohan's face maybe like kind of oh i'm missing a piece hang on all right here we go it is finally focused we're good to go so uh i was missing the nimbus trail right here but other than that, there you go. Like, so yeah, Gohan and Goku's face kind of look kind of funny, but I don't think you'd really even like notice that. Like, especially since it's a massive like diorama and stuff and the detailing on it, like even like the little city in the background and stuff like that. This is a really good, really good collector's edition. Now, someone who used to buy a lot of these and I stopped because I feel like the things you were getting in a lot of these collector's editions just were not worth the extra like hundred bucks, you know? This still book case, this diorama and that hardback really really nice and there you go that was today's double unboxing here two mystery gifts sent over from bandai shout out to bandai namco for uh all the stuff man this is like, this is a lot of stuff dude and of course we'll be continuing our dragon ball z kakarot playthrough uh gonna be having a ton of fun with that so guys if you're new to the channel and enjoyed today's video you might hit that subscribe button you might also hit that like button have a great great day keep on keeping on nanogenics off and i'll see you all in the next video I guess.